What's going on, everybody? Z here, and welcome to Astroneer. So we are starting a fresh new game. That is right. We're starting over. We're starting fresh for the summer update. We've been playing the same save for a couple months now, and it is time to start over. How wonderful. So uh, we're going to go with, I think we're going we're gonna to stick with the sunrise. We're going to stick with the flight suit, a.k.a. pajamas, which is what it should be named. But uh, as always, if you guys enjoy the episode, don't forget to leave a like. And if you haven't already and you're new here, maybe consider subscribing as well. Um, all right. I like that they, they made like a little pod. Oh, it's so nice. Okay. They made it like pop out. It was super cool. It was super amazing. All right. So uh, let's see where we're going to land. We should land somewhere near-ish the North Pole. That's, that's usually the ideal place. Do not. Okay. Oh, I was about to say, don't put me in a mountain. Um, ooh. This is not a bad looking area. No, it looks pretty good. All right, cool. Let's do the things. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. I don't know how they fit this inside that pod, but uh, good on them for doing so. <gasps> oh, look at that. We did a thing. We did a thing. All right, cool. So I'm not going to forget to do this because I always forget to do this. Uh, oxygenator. We'll throw that right there. Wait, did that not like? What just happened? I need. Okay, there we go. Good. It's not connected. Did you connect? Perfect. All right. There's that. A starting medium printer and a starting platform. How wonderful. All right. So if you guys are new to Ashnir, you're just getting into it. Well, this is a great time as always. We just had the summer update come out, so uh, we have. We have some new things and some new things to play with. So that is exciting as well. Um, why does, oh, it has to be, yeah, that's right. It's a two slot. Duh. Oh my gosh. It's like I've never played before. <gasps> oh, I love starting a new save. The possibilities are just endless. Absolutely endless. All right. So I have zero bytes. I need to make, t I have tethers, uh, oxygen filters, a canister, a small generator, a beacon, a work light. Oh, they, hmm. Unlocked from the beginning, I see. I like it. I like it indeed. indeed. Okay, let's grab some resin real quick. Now, like I said, I don't want to... Uh, typically how I do my saves, I don't like to dig a whole bunch right next to my base. I like to kind of go out and get stuff and then bring it back. Uh, so I'll, I'll do a little bit of digging here and whatnots, but I don't like digging massive holes everywhere because then you have to kind of deal with them around your base all the time. Uh, but like over here, we could probably go ahead and take out that chunk right there. <gasps> Ooh, we have a crash satellite over there. How wonderful. I like it. Let's go ahead and make a canister to start with. That way we can collect some soils and do some flattening of things. Because I want to get this kind of flattened up right around here for our base. Um, we have... Nope. It's a fake cave entrance. Wonderful. What about right here? Is this an actual cave entrance? Oh... We have an actual cave entrance. <laughs> oh, alrighty. Very neato. Very neato. All right. So, uh, we need compound. I guess we could get a little bit of compound too. Why not? Um, this is actually probably far enough away from my base. So I'll, I'll just try to dig up some of this if I can. Uh, cancer is looking okay. Going to need a bunch of resin for all of the fun things. And then we need to start doing some research as well. That way we can get some things unlocked. However, um, I, uh, I hate building. There's a platform that I hate building and everybody knows that I do not like building this platform. I don't like it. It's the platform we get started off with. It's the one that's unlocked from the beginning. The large platform type A. I don't like the type A. I just, I just don't like it. I, I much rather go with a platform type B. Because you get the two extra side slots. It's only 500 bytes. It's not super hard to get. So we will be waiting for that. Uh, you know what? We need a small printer. Where's the... Uh, I need a little teeny tiny... Little tiny guy. Just a little teeny tiny guy. I don't know why we start off with a medium printer. I'm actually kind of wondering... I've always wondered that. Because you can use a small printer to print a medium printer. You know what I mean? I don't know. I don't... I don't know. Uh, okay. So I only have a couple of things unlocked here. The medium printer, the medium storage, and medium platform type A. Um, how much does it cost to unlock the platform type, the medium platform type C? 400 for that guy. Ooh, that's kind of expensive. And a thousand for the tall platform. Jeez Louise! Um, hmm. 
let's go ahead and let's print up uh, let's print up one of these guys, some storage, so I can storinate some stuff. I'm going to try to keep things organized. I always say that, literally every time I start a new series. But sometimes it happens and sometimes it doesn't. Never mind. It pretty much never happens. <laughs> pretty much never happens. Uh, and then let's do a, a a platform. Take this guy. We'll drop our inventory stuff on here. And then we're going to go get some research and get some bites so we can do some things with some stuff. Uh, okay, so there's this guy. We'll put you on here, like a sword. Uh, okay. Actually, yeah, we'll have it this way. And we'll just plop you down right there. Good to go. Alright, so we'll throw all of this on there. Um, we will keep a... Hmm. We'll keep a resin with us. Actually, we should probably make some tethers. Let's make some tethers, too. Uh, we'll make two stacks and we're gonna head into the cave we're Probably gonna head into there and then uh, try to find some some little research deals. Uh, is there any there's a there's a research pod there Oh, there's copper right there Okay, not bad Not bad. Let's head down here and see what we got. I spy some aluminum over there And oh here we go. These are the little dudes that I want Yeah, look at that. That's boom. That's like already a hundred right there easy peasy easy peasy now we just have to find more of those um more of the research deals more of the research yeah i don't see any <laughs> all right we're gonna keep going down into the cave yeah let's just keep going all right this looks like a big nice open cave area i think this will do just fine for us all right perfect we got a couple more of these little dudes <gasps> oh these ones are worth a little bit more too um there's a couple over there there's some aluminum, and I think there was some sephalerite over here as well. Let's go ahead and start making our way over here. So how I like to do things, if you guys haven't been watching, if you're new here, I like to uh, kind of run tether lines out through the caves before I do like a whole lot of exploring, just because it's uh well it's, it's handy because then you can just have a tether line. You can always break off from it if you need to. Um, let's make a hole through here. This cave kind of it kind of wraps around and instead of putting tethers all the way across I'd rather just go through this through this little uh, little cave wall right here and look at that there's some research on the other side of that fantastic absolutely fantastic okay so um there's a ton of resin here Wow all right let's go ahead and get a get a nice little little thing going down right here perfect looking good all right uh, oh, there's a couple here. Yay! Oh, those ones are only 40. Okay, random. Random number game here. Um, oh, there's some right there, right there, right there. Okay, let's try to... I think that was my last one. That was my last one indeed. All right, let's just dig up here. I want to run around and I want to grab a whole bunch of these. Um, these little deals right here, they need power. And I don't have enough power. That's what the little indication is. Is this like a charge? Yeah, no, it's not. Some of these have like a little battery bar next to them and all you do is have to charge them up so you don't have to like have a certain amount of power but that one specifically you have to have a certain amount of power for it to actually work and those ones are never fun because it always seems like they require uh well a, dec a decent amount of power before it'll actually work uh let's just get you right here oxygenate up and we'll probably go over there what are our bites at we're at 461 already not even a problem very easy. Now, I don't know. I don't know how I'm going to get bites after this. Um, because before we would do Astronium. Astronium was the main the main uh, source of bites for us. However, with the recent nerf of Astronium, that's really not going to work out for us anymore. So I don't know what we're going to be doing. We're probably going to be looking for artificial research, mostly. Because that stuff's always worth it. Uh... But, yeah, the Astronium. Oh, I just they killed the Astronium again. I can't believe it. Yes, I can. <laughs> yes, I can. All right. You know what? I'm just going to make an oxygen filter. I know where I'm at. I'm not going too far away. But I don't want to go back. I want to uh, I want to just collect as much of this stuff as I can. As much of this good, good stuff. Oh, oh, gas pod. I see you. And he's gone. Yay. <gasps> Is that gas pod seed? Oh, that's what's up. I forgot. Okay, so they added new seeds to the game where you can get seeds off of plants that are, like, deadly. But then you get a non-deadly variant of them. Is that a is that a working one? No, it's not. Darn it. I was hoping that was a good one. 
Uh, so I hadn't got one of those before yet. That's pretty neato. Pretty neato. Um, okay, let's not get lost here. Oh, geez, but all of the researchy stuffs. I need it all. I need it all. Um, okay, let's start making our way back over here. I believe we, I think our stuff's right over here. If I'm not mistaken, I might be mistaken though. Uh oh. Oh, no, we're good. Okay, whew. Good to go. Uh, what are our bites at now? We're at 1300 bites now. Just for grabbing these little things floating around. Uh, let's go check back here. Tons of aluminum down here. Ooh, that's going to be super handy. Very, very handy indeed. Um, okay, let's see. More aluminum there. More uh, cephalorite there and or zinc. Ooh, that's a good generator. We're taking that back with us. I love finding these generators. <laughs> I feel like it's, they're they're super handy. And uh, one, if you can find one like super early, you, you have a decent source of power now. Because... All you do is have to get organic. You you put it through a smelter, and then you can use it on this guy. Since there's no longer coal. All right. Um, I think we're good. Let's go ahead and head back up to the base, and let's get some things done. All right. So we have the bites we need. Like I said, we are gonna go with a medium, a large platform type B to start with, because it only it requires three resin, 500 bites, easy peasy, no problemo. Uh, now I need a smelting furnace as well. A soil centrifuge would be nice, but right now, those those are pretty much what I need. Uh, research chamber's already unlocked. Fantastic. Grab you. Oh, that's right. We have a mutant hibiscus seed. Um, I don't know where I want to put that yet, though. Hmm. I don't know, because I want to go off of here, and I want to kind of flatten out a little bit. Let's, let's, let me do that real quick. That looks pretty good. Kind of a uh, kind of rectangular squarical design thing. I don't know. It looks fun. Anyways, I think we're gonna go ahead and put our plants in here. I'm gonna try to leave this area of like a natural foliage, and then have just plants like up through here. Now I have never seen the uh, the the mutant version of this, so I'm curious if it's gonna make any kind of like gassy kind of things. I don't know. I have no idea. Uh, okay, so let me go ahead and put the compound away. I grab some compound while we're uh, while we're doing the flattenings. And I believe that's it. Okay, perfect. Well, not perfect, but uh, we need more resin. Hmm. See, this is where the uh, the soil centrifuge is super handy. We do have these guys too. I could grab some of these. These are probably worth like 20, yeah, 20 ish, about 20 ish. So that's why I like going into the caves and grabbing them because then you get more per, per deal. Now you can grab these and throw them on the research chamber and you actually get more uh, by doing that, you do. But I didn't have a platform that I wanted to use because I didn't want to make the other platforms. I didn't want to make that a thing. <laughs> uh, okay, so there's those. Um, all right, I need to go grab some resin. Let's see, there was resin. There was resin like over there. Let's go grab that. All right, let's go ahead and make a large platform type B. Perfect, fantastic. And then I also want to make some storage too. Let's make another storage module. We'll build that guy. Uh, we don't really have a whole lot of power right now. That's okay. It's going to be a struggle for, for a little bit. But once we get some smelting powers, we can get this guy online. We could go around and find some batteries. We could find some power stuff. Uh, you can see there's a broken wind turbine right right there. Uh, that is a possibility. You can find those completely working along with like full-size solar panels too. Uh, I want to go grab this copper though so I can make a work light. Because it is very hard to see and I understand that. And uh, oh, this is not going to be a full thing of... This is not going to be a full thing of copper. It's 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 the the joke copper. It's like look at that. There's no other copper even around here. Oh, what a jerk! What a jerk! Okay. Um. Eesh. Any more copper anywhere? Oh, there's actually some right there. Do I have any resin? I don't. All right, I better get back. I don't want to. We don't want to die this early on. All right, I changed my mind. I just grabbed some resin, made a filter. We'll be good. <laughs> um, I want to see if this copper over here is an actual deposit. I see a piece of copper. It's not normally on the ground like this, so I doubt it's actually... Uh, 
actually. Meh. Oh? No. Nope. Uh, false alarm. Oh! Oh! Oh, I thought that was I thought that was a copper piece. Stick it out. No! Um No copper. Okay. Um There's some right there. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Okay. We'll go grab this. I need to make a work light for you guys. Let's not die. Let's not die. Oh, there's some right here too. I don't have a train tool though. Oh well, we'll grab this stuff to start with. Hopefully, I just need one piece. Oh, we got the one piece. All right. Now we did break through to a snow layer, and snow layer is an easy layer to dig. Yep, no, it's gone. Okay. All right, we got the one piece. That's all we need for now. Let's go ahead and we'll take this back. I will get a work light built for you guys. S like stat. ASAP. It's gonna happen. It's a thing. I promise. Yay! Our platform's done. Okay, cool. So let's go ahead and get this guy out. Uh, we'll put you over here for now. Now I will reorganize all of this once uh once we have more platforms, because like I won't typically use these small things for a whole lot of things, but we need them for now. Alright. Now, um I need a smelting furnace. Let's go ahead and make a smelting furnace. Let's do that right now. That way we can start smelting things, because once we can start smelting organic, we can use the generator, and that'll actually give us some power on the regular. Um, hmm. What are our bites at? We're at 901. Uh, a soil centrifuge is very, very handy. A soil centrifuge is very, very handy. However, so is a tractor. And a tractor is a thousand. Requires two aluminum. Not terrible. A tractor is like very handy because it's portable. It's essentially portable oxygen, right? Um. Hmm. I think we're gonna go with the tractor next. I think the tractor needs to happen. That basically takes our area of being able to go out and do things from a tether line to literally everywhere. Just don't get lost doing so. Speaking of don't get lost, do we have beacons yet? Or beacon? Beacons are unlocked already and they require quartz. Okay. Uh, let's go and grab some quartz real quick because we can also turn it into glass and later on we'll need that for a oxygen tank. Which I would unlock, but unfortunately, I, uh, I don't have the bites for it yet. Hey, there's some quartz. All right, perfect. Okay, let's grab these. Uh, I like to grab a few. And when we go out and actually start exploring stuff, it's always good to have some beacons. I've gotten lost way too many times in this game. It is not fun to lose your base and have no idea where you're at. And then you lose all your stuff because you end up dying somehow. It's a terrible, horrible disaster. We don't want a terrible, horrible disaster. No, thank you. This is a lot of quartz. Wow, that's a lot of quartz. I am very surprised at how much quartz is actually here. I'm going to gather all of this until my terrain tool is completely full. And then I'll have a whole bunch of quartz for no reason. All right, that's all I can get. <laughs> our backpack is covered in quartz. That was a lot of quartz. Hey, our smelter is done too. Yay. Okay, let's get that guy out. And then the first thing I want to do is one of these. Go ahead and turn that guy on. And then this guy. Uh, we're going to actually move this here. We'll put that there. Actually, no. Um. Well, I don't know. We'll have to see. Okay, and I want another platform. One, two. Uh, that's right. I have a lot of quartz. Lots of quartz in my inventories. Okay, let's do that one. There, there. Uh, print that guy. This guy's almost done. Once this is done, we can throw this on here. We'll start getting a whole bunch more power. It'll be fantastic. That's not going to be enough power to do like a lot of things, but like it'll do a few things. And it's done. Okay, perfect. There we go. All right. Powered up. Good to go. Much better. Uh, it was very lucky for us to find one of these guys this early in the game. It's very handy to have. <laughs> Extremely handy to have. But I want to get a whole bunch of these platforms built up. Unfortunately, I have to build these. I would love, I would love to skip straight to uh, the extra large platform type C. I would love to skip straight towards that, but I can't. It costs 5,000 bytes, two iron, two steel. So obviously we have to get to that. And then we're gonna have a whole bunch of these platforms just chilling because yeah, I, that's just how things work, I guess. <laughs> Yay, another platform. Okay, cool. Um, We'll just stick it right here on the end. Perfect. 
that guy's doing its thing um i am making all of the uh the organic into uh charcoal or carbon sorry because we're gonna use it for power right now anyways um why don't you connect connect there we go okay perfect connected up good to go um i don't really need anything like this right now per se so we're just gonna go ahead and let it do its thing now the next thing we do we do need a research chamber so i think it should be the next thing we make uh research chamber one resin two compound easy peasy go ahead do that since we're doing two things at once we'll go ahead and fire up that generator let it do its thing over here do that do i have more quartz i do indeed um can I, I i really wish like i understand why they changed the mechanics of this but at the same time before you used to have the force loss on here and it would like it would it was better but like now it's it's really weird because it doesn't I don't know. I just haven't got used to it, I think. Uh, okay, so there's that. I have so I have so much quartz, it's silly. It's absolutely silly. Um, and then we're going to need that, and then we're going to need a soil centrifuge. Did I unlock the soil centrifuge yet? Not yet, because I'm going to do the tractor next. That's right. And the research chamber's done! Yeah! Alright, so we'll get that guy out. Uh, nextly, resin. Is that all the resin I have? Well, darn it. I was hoping I had a little bit, teeny, tiny bit more resin than that. Okay. So we need to do some research. I think there was a research pod like right. Yeah, there's one like right here. We'll stick this guy. Let it do its researching things for now. It's not a great one, but it is one nonetheless. 450 bytes, seven minutes. That's fine. If it's fully powered, it's not gonna be fully powered. Oh, look at our wonderful little plant. Oh, it is making the little gas things. Oh, it's so cool. I like it. So we're gonna throw our plants that we find in this area right here. It's gonna be like our, our natural garden, our natural observation garden. We're scientists here, you know. Uh, okay, so there's that. Uh, I want to go check out that wreck as well, but I really, I, I'm kind of leaning towards the soil centrifuge, honestly, because we have two canisters full of soil. Those two canisters are going to turn into eight resin, and then eight resin turns into, you know, more storage, more platforms, more everything. So the soil centrifuge is kind of a big deal. But if we have a tractor, we can go out and find stuff and possibly find research things that give us a whole heck of a lot more research, too. Oh, we are in a predicament right now. Oh, all of our research things respond. Wonderful. All right, well, I guess we're going to do research that. So these guys, if you leave them alone, if you don't dig them up, they actually respawn the uh, the little research points. So a super handy way of getting research. Actually, honestly, it might be the fastest way now for now. Uh, no, it, it probably is definitely the fastest way right now. Yeah, yeah, it probably is. So we're just going to go ahead and we'll have a little route. Um, I should, what I should do is I th should throw a tether. Oh, I was going to make a work light. Oh, let me go make a work light. All right. Where's that copper? There we go. Let's make a work light. That way we can actually see what the heck we're doing. So you guys can see what the heck we're doing <laughs> because it's terrible when you can't see anything. Uh, I like the work light on this side. I'm sorry. It's just, it's just, a th it's a thing. It's a thing. Okay. Uh, grab some compound. I want to make a tether line because I want to kind of mark out the, um, the little research posts down there with tethers that way i know like uh essentially i could have like a path that oh i just follow this path of tethers right there i'll get all the research deals call it good to go because last time we got like 1300 from doing this area so uh this one was one right here i know you're one and then i don't think we hit any more yet we were kind of going i think we went this way mostly if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, 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 yeah. We went this way. Ooh, I almost dug that one out. It's a good thing I did not. All right, so that's one. So we'll grab these. I want to dig this out so we can at least get up here. Uh, I'll put one right here so I know that's one. Fantastic. Um, There's some over here. Okay, and then so one here. And then one right there. Just, I'm just marking them out, you know? So there's those. Uh, one right here. Grab this guy. And there's some more over here, but I might be running out of tethers now. Yeah, I'm running out of tethers. Okay. Grab you. All right. Well, I mean, that's better than what it was. And I can see, I can still see some more over there. All right. Let me go grab these real quick and yeah it's this one and this one then we got these two right here fantastic 
And I think that's all of them for right here. Oh, there's one right there. Okay, we'll grab this guy too. All right, we are at 1,800 bytes now. Good to go. Actually, that's enough to get the uh, the tractor right away. Boom, there's that. Uh, this guy's 1,500 bytes for the trailer. The trailer is super handy. Um, However, I think the soil centrifuge is going to be next. And I think I actually have enough bytes for the soil centrifuge, if I'm not mistaken. Perfect. Liking it. Loving it. Um... All right, I need more. I need, I need more bites though. I need more. Uh, oh, you know what? I need aluminum for the tractor. So let's grab that aluminum too, whilst we're here. Yay, we have aluminum now too. Fantastic. Um, okay, all right, things are looking good. Things are looking good. I'm gonna go ahead and throw these on here, like so, and then, um, oh, poopsies, I need more resin. I need this guy. One aluminum and two compound. Oh, that's perfect, actually, because I'm making the aluminum right now. <gasps> Fantastic. All right. So, uh, yeah, that's actually going to end this episode, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to leave a like. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe as well for some more. Again, we're going to play an Astro probably all week this week. I am out of town. Uh, these are all pre-recorded, so leave your comments down below. I will read them, but they will not be responded to until I get back. But thank you guys so much. Appreciate the support. You guys are all amazing. I'll see you in the next one.